Hundreds of these tricycle operators, mainly members of the Pragya Riders Association, were taken through various road safety tips by officers of the National Road Safety Authority, the MTTD, the Ghana National Fire Service and the DVLA at the Techiman Zungo LA Park. The move, according to the regional head of the National Road Safety Authority, Emmanuel Champon Pari, is to, amongst other things, improve the operator's level of awareness of road traffic regulations to help minimize the increasing number of road accidents involving motorcycles. Today, we have met uh, the Praga and motor riders in the Techiman municipality, and we are training them uh, to exhibit proper road safety skills on the road. We are giving them education uh, so that when they are using the road, they will be very, very careful. Uh, last year, out of the 129 deaths that were recorded in the Bono East region, uh, 85 were the deaths caused by the Pragya and Motu riders, which is very, very alarming. Almost 65% of the problem came from the Pragya and the Motu riders. So we thought it wise to bring them together, to train them so that uh, we will see improvement in the coming years in terms of road traffic deaths and fatalities. Municipal Chief Executive for Tichiman, Benjamin Yabajako, lauded the leadership of the Pragya Riders Association for the training and noted that the Assembly would continue to support the riders in terms of promoting their operations. It is always said that if you don't go for refresher training in the work or in your field of endeavor, you end up not knowing what is happening in your field of operation. So this is a very wake-up call that I commend the executives for initiating this um, meeting for their members. And I assure you once again that myself and my Honorable MP, our MP, Honorable Martin J. Mensah Kosa, will continue to be our, our servants and then listen to you and then, I mean, champion your cause at all levels to help promote your operations. Chairman of the Pragya Riders Association, Awal Mohammed, appealed to authorities to legalize the operations of the tricycle business, which according to him, will provide jobs for the teeming unemployed youth. We can, we can count about thousands of Ghanaians. Techman alone, we are, we, we are about 2,000 riders in Techman. So, and I think that it is very, very important that Ghanaian authorities have, ten, have a look at them and see that it is an industry that when regulated well will give more of our youth job. With various restrictions imposed on the operations of these riders, some of them appeal to city authorities to ease some of these restrictions to enable them to survive in this harsh economy. As a concerned Praga rider in Techima, we have many, many challenges that we are facing. That is the limitation of our work time in Techima. It is really affecting us. So we are appealing to the traditional Techima Traditional Council, the chief and its elders, to please come to our aid. Because the time they've given us to close work, 10 p.m., is really affecting us. We are best friends and anonymous. Abrena or Modia Mayeno, Ka Omon Chinqua and Mukakra, Nanka, Ebia, Enfri, and Opanum Cosi, and Ajube Dumienu. Minim said Dumienu, dear, never be a more tidy, Obia on Naya, dear, never be a yasu a day, and an hour and Ajay say, Marana and an animal and only so. Reporting for Joy News, Anas Sabit, Tichima.